Namaste, dear friends. We are exploring the Panchamaya model of the Taittiriya Upanishad and how it relates to yoga. Last time we talked about the beautiful model of the physiological dimension called the Annamaya. Today we will graduate to the second dimension that is called Pranamaya. Prana means energy and therefore Pranamaya is that domain that is nourished by energy. See, apart from a physical body, we are also an energetic body. That is how we are able to function. A dead body cannot function because there is no energy. Therefore, there is some energy in a living body that is making us function and that energy is called prana at a very fundamental level. Of course, this prana has different dimensions as well based on the functions of this energy. But generally, we need energy to function and fulfill our life, be it on a daily mundane basis or to fulfill our dharma. So pranamaya represents our energetic dimension and the Taittiri Upanishad says that of course there are different types of prana but three of them are considered very vital. What is called prana which is the vitalizing energy that which manifests things, apana that which helps us letting go and viana that which is distributing energy or carrying energy to all parts of the body. Now of course there are many other pranas as well. Yoga talks about five major pranas and five secondary pranas and then many more pranas are there. But essentially these three are the most important. Now when you look at our energetic dimension pranamaya we are also very different from each other. Some of us have much more energy in the morning time. Some of us have much more energy in the evening time. Some of us have much more energy in the summer. Some of us have much more energy in the winter. Some of us have much more energy when we eat food. Some of us have more energy when we fast. Some of us have much more energy when we eat certain kinds of food. Some of us have much more energy when we eat other kinds of food. The company we keep nourishes us one way with energy and sometimes in the wrong company our energy gets depleted. The same people may not create the same reactions to each of us. And as we age also energy levels changes. So this is what is called the pranamaya, our energetic dimension which is also a dynamic dimension and we are also significantly different from each other in this energetic dimension as well. That's why even when we give practices, we cannot give the same practice to everybody because for somebody they may have more energy, they can do longer practice. Somebody else, they may have lesser energy, they, do, they have to do shorter practices but maybe more than once a day. Some people, the practice may have to be in the morning time. Some people, the practice may have to be in the evening time because the energy levels are different. So pranamaya also figures greatly into the decision making of what kind of practices are suitable for some and what kind of practices are suitable for others. The same practices cannot be given for everybody because at an energetic dimension as well, we are all very different. So this, my dear friends, is a very simple explanation of what is the pranamaya, our energetic dimension, and how it figures into the calculations of what kind of practices we have to give to some and what kind of practices we have to give others. Meditate on this, my dear friends. Namaste. Namaste, my dear friends. I am Kaustubha Desi Kachar of the Vini Yoga tradition. And if you have come to this point of our video, it means 
that you have enjoyed our videos and if you would like to support us even more by clicking the subscribe button and also clicking on the bell notifications icon then you will give us a wonderful sign that you are interested that we keep continuing to make such remarkable videos and share with you so that this knowledge can spread all across humanity for the benefit of humanity. In this moment where we are in history, we are in an important time where sharing such sacred and precious knowledge becomes very, very useful. And that is what motivates us to keep doing this every week. And we really hope that you enjoy the watching this and please feel free to share it with your friends, share it in your circles so that many, many people can benefit from this. We love you, our fans, our students, and our friends, and we look forward to seeing you in yet another video of our channel. Namaste.